How's it going guys? As you can see, I am back. <laughs> it's been a been a minute since I've done a video, but uh it's it's for a good thing. I haven't done any videos specifically because I had to save money and after the Lotso box, which if you guys haven't seen, please go back and watch it. I my reaction to it is pretty amazing and uh yeah, definitely still can't believe I got this in the uh, Smy World Mystery Box, the $150 box. And yeah, it was uh, definitely something I didn't expect. But uh, I wanted to catch everybody up on what I've been getting. If you guys didn't see the live stream last night... Oh, gotta move this a little bit. Um, if you guys didn't see the last night, I talked about some of these pops that I picked up. But uh, I'll at least give you a refresher on what I did because there was a lot of people in that live stream and it happens. But uh, the first one I got while over uh, the Christmas holiday, I got uh, Vanellope here. She was on uh, 7 bucks a pop, their drop that they, they did with it. Now this one I got before the next one I'm going to show you, but uh, I got Vanellope. Um... Now, if you guys don't know, I'm a big Disney guy, and I needed Vanellope for this line. And uh, I already have Turbo, so now I need Wreck-It, Felix, and King Candy. And I've heard King Candy is expensive, but I gotta get this line going because I wanna I wanna try and finish it up. <laughs> but uh, it's gonna be kind of tough. But uh, here she is. Now she came in at a seven. Or 7.5 out of 10. And and if you didn't know why, it's because of there's a little, if I can see, there's a little line going down right here. And it uh, it's basically when somebody probably put it in a protector. It just went right down the row of it. And uh, it just took some of the, the actual paint of it or the box a little bit. Which is fine with me because this... This is going to stay with me until pretty much it's either I can't finish the line and then get rid of it because of uh, me trying to finish other Disney lines or I just keep it and finish my line. I want to try and finish this line because I actually like Wreck-It Ralph. If you guys don't know with Disney, they, their movies are amazing. Plus, I got Disney Plus and I have watched The Mandalorian. It is very, 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 very good. Alright, so the next one I got is not in a Disney line, but it's one I've been looking for ever since I started doing Funkos. Now, back when I started, back in 2011, I was, uh, I was just picking up random things. But then I seen that this was out and, well, this came out in 2013 but when I started doing it, I was like, okay, well, they should make a Ghost Rider. And then years go by, years go by, and they actually made Ghost Rider. And he was pretty expensive. He was up there with price. I think I paid um, about 80 or No, no, no. I paid less for this one because, of course, 7 bucks a pop. It had... Uh, some uh, damage on the side. It's got some creasing right here. If you guys can see that. Yeah, right there. But uh, it was also a 7.5 out of 10, which is fine with me because this one is definitely staying. Wanted Ghost Rider for the longest time. Now, the, the really big pops that I've always, always wanted was the Metallic Genie, the Metallic Ghost Rider, and... The uh, Ace Ventura, because I loved Ace Ventura. And uh, those were like the three big ones that I've always been looking for. But if I have an opportunity to try and grab one, like I've been trying to grab one of the uh, Metallic Genies for the longest time, but can never get an opportunity to. But uh, being able to get this Lotso, one of my higher pops that I've always been wanting besides like those three but man metallic genie has always been one of those things that just is in the grasp that but then just gets out 
But uh, I'm glad I got this one because, like I said, this one I've been looking for a long time. And I like his eyes because they're white instead of the normal black. Oh, man. This was cool to get. This was cool to get. And then some random pickups that I got just from stores and stuff. A uh, buddy of mine told me about uh, the Birds of Prey, the new uh, DC... Or, yeah, the new DC uh, Harley Quinn movie. And I was like, okay, well, not really into Harley Quinn. But then they told me about one of the characters that was in it, which was Ronan Sinosis. And he, from what I'm, I've heard, he's the one who's supposed to be Black Mask. And from what I've seen, um, the actor who's playing him is actually pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, cannot, uh, cannot complain from what I seen with the trailers. He's a pretty cool bad guy, but, uh, I got the normal one there. And then of course I've got the chase version here. The cool part about this, I found both of these in the same area. So I just picked them both up and they were both in good condition. So if, uh, I, I told my friend, if he didn't want them, let me know. Cause then if not, I'm just going to try and, uh, get rid of them on, uh, Mercari, because I'm a big, I, I don't want to say I'm a big fan of Birds of Prey, but I might keep the regular one, to be honest, but I would probably get rid of the Chase, because everyone's freaking out about Chases nowadays, so I don't, I think I'll find another one eventually at some point, so it'll just depend. If he wants it, I'll give it to him. But with that, that's pretty much all I've gotten in the last couple of weeks. Besides uh, this commissioned art piece right here. And it's of Ellie from The Last of Us, part two. And that is probably the coolest thing I've ever done along the lines of that. Because they did the art piece for me. And then I had it put up on a canvas. So that's actually a canvas art piece. And it is amazing. But uh, besides all of that, it's just been Christmas and having everyone here and just doing the Christmas thing. But uh, I do plan on having some more boxes eventually. Um, I know for a fact I'm going to have two uh, Pop King Paul boxes, and it's the $15 boxes that he recently just did. He said there were a hundred, a hundred boxes, and they were 15 bucks a piece, but he wasn't guaranteeing value because, of course, they were so low in price, he just wasn't guaranteeing anything. So I bought two of those, and they sold out within five minutes again. Um, I planned on opening those up on a video, and I just recently got a Chrono Toys $30 box. Now, with their $30 boxes that they just showed, um, they were $30, but you can guarantee anything from $60 to $100. So I'm like, okay, not bad. I'll take that. And they didn't specify if it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, or anything. So. Hopefully I don't get a box full of like six different pops all at 10 bucks. I'll be a little upset with that one. But uh, yeah, that's all I pretty much had. And uh, if you guys enjoyed, please let me know down below. And of course, now I have to tell you guys, I do have an affiliate link now. It is with Shumi on their pop protectors. Now, if you guys haven't seen Shumi's pop protectors, they are actually very good. Um, I'm not telling you to use my link. If you just want to get some pop protectors, all I'm saying is use my link. You get discounts on those protectors, and it also helps me out a little bit too. I uh, Everything I get goes right back into these pops and makes more videos. So if you guys do want pop protectors or needing of pop protectors, use my link down below. It'll get you guys some good, good protectors. Now, uh... That's pretty much it, and hopefully I see you guys in the next video, and not in two weeks again, <laughs> but I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.